Hi, this is Justice with Tablet Pro, and I wanted to do a very quick update uh, on Clip Studio Paint version 1.5.4. And, and this is actually a very big update. And uh, one of the biggest things that you're going to notice immediately is that it looks sexy. And that's not something that Clip Studio Paint is known for. Uh, they usually have these uh, multi-tone, dual-tone icons on the side and they were outdated and they just did not look very good. And so they've updated the UI completely. They've added a number of different features. And uh, you can see here, this is running on the Surface Pro X. It's got this beautiful screen. It's nice and fluid. Um, I'm not seeing any lag and uh, we're able to use all the different brushes uh, the way that we would expect them to. This is a 3000 by 3000 canvas. Uh, let's open layers here. And this is what I want. But I don't seem to have it mapped anywhere. Does anyone use that pixel brush? I don't like it. Can I remove it? Hey. That's kind of cool. All right, let's get back to something pretty. <laughs> All right. So just wanted to give you guys an update. So here you can see they go through a number of different things that have been added to Clip Studio Paint version 1.9.5. And I may have said that wrong before. So 1.9.5, you can see the redesigned uh, UI is, is much nicer to look at. It's easier to see uh, clear. Again, it's because they don't have those same uh, dual tone icons. Uh, you can directly import um, from and save to files app, which is an iPad feature, so uh, I don't care, and main improvements. So here's a massive list of all the different things that have been improved in this version. So if you guys would like to take a look at that and see some of the different things, I'll put the link to the release notes right here. And da -da -da -da, there is Clip Studio Paint out finally for iPhone, which is pretty cool. Uh, it is a subscription model, which is like $2 a month, which is less cool. Uh, but more cool is you can use it for an hour a day for free, uh, which is pretty neat. So if you're using Clip Studio a lot on your phone, you're going to have to pay for it, but it's very reasonable. And if not, then um, you can use it for an hour. So that's pretty cool. Uh, for those of you guys who are not familiar with this channel, um, this is the Artist Pad from Tablet Pro. I'll link to that in the description as well. And you guys can go ahead and uh, grab that and give that a try. It's a great tool, especially if you're using a tablet. Uh, also just released a video on the tablet holder, which is holding this up, and released a video on this stylus which is the Raphael um, 520, so two button stylus, and uh, allows you to do things like color pick, um, as well as uh, other functions on the front button, although I don't have anything mapped to it yet in Clip Studio. All right, you guys, uh, that's it. Like I said, really quick video. Uh, if you guys haven't subscribed, this is a great channel for artists, note takers, creatives, anyone who uses a touchscreen tablet uh, my goal is to bring you information that will help you do a better job 
in more places on your tablets. All right, I hope you have a wonderful day, and until next time, stay creative.